Good morning, guys. We are hanging out today. It has been kind of hectic the last few days. I did not vlog at all yesterday, and that was just for a few reasons. One is because the night before last, I all of a sudden felt really nauseous. I honestly thought I was getting a stomach bug, and I never ended up throwing up or anything, but that was the closest to throwing up I have been since the last time I threw up. So I was pretty much up all night just feeling super nauseous and kind of like wishing that I would throw up, if you know what I mean. Like when you're just so sick, you're like, I just wish I would throw up so I could feel better. But it ended up not being anything. I finally fell asleep like at 3 a.m. I think. And then yesterday I felt fine. I was like a little bit weak and like tired, but I don't know what that was. Maybe I ate something, I have no idea. So yesterday after I woke up, had no sleep and we weren't really doing anything yesterday. So I decided to just take a day off of vlogging. That way last night I didn't have to edit a video or anything and I can just go to bed at a decent hour, which I did and I feel refreshed. The other reason I did not vlog is because just that, we didn't really do anything and we were kind of just getting caught up on chores and stuff. I will say today I have semi done my hair and semi done my makeup and I actually feel like I can like do something today. I honestly love the days where we are in our pajamas all day long and I don't do my makeup or my hair and we're just playing and spending time with each other. But we have done that for the last four days I feel like and so Today was a little bit different. I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get up, I'm gonna do my makeup, my hair, and now I kind of feel like I can do a bunch of stuff around the house. I'm not gonna be lazy. So there's that. Um, we probably won't be leaving. I think Chris has a lot of errands he has to run, but other than that, I don't know if the kids and I are gonna go anywhere. I'm talking quiet, because she's sleeping. Also, Jane and Jackson have been playing so well together, but they tend to shut doors and be a little bit sneaky, so we're gonna What are you doing? Are you allowed to have my phone right now? Nope. No. But we want to. Watch. What are you guys doing? We're just laying in the tent and having a rest. Oh. Because yesterday we didn't. So, this is actually really cute because, like I said, they've been hanging out a lot together lately. And look, they have a little blanket in here. Jackson got his passy and his lovey out of his crib, it looks like. How come Jackson's not watching anything? Jane? How come Jackson's not eat, uh, watching anything with you? It wasn't a tiger. Or a mouse. Jane. How come Jackson's not watching anything with you? This is why she's actually not allowed to watch my phone or her iPad unless it's quiet time. Mainly for that reason. One, because she would watch it all day if I let her. But two, because she doesn't ever listen to what I'm saying. She's like enthralled with what she's watching. So I'm going to have to take that away. Why don't we play something? I'm going to wake up Piper. Jackson stinks a little bit. But that's cute. They've been quiet in here for ten minutes. Now I know why. Because they've been watching the film. But anyways, I'm going to go wake up Piper. She had her morning nap. She's always so happy when she wakes up. So let's see if we can get a smile out of her today. <clears throat> Here she is. Good morning. Hey, sweet girl. Did you have a good nap? You got your lovey? Hi. Good morning. Piper. Hi. What are you playing?
playing with? So the one pet peeve I have about kid toys that like have noise or turn on or like play music is that they don't last very long and I swear, I don't know if it's just ours and how we treat our toys or something, but do they ever do where you'd like turn it on and it's like glitched out. It's like bloop, 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 you know, like just doesn't play the music anymore. It's just like over and over making the same noise. I swear like probably 50% of our toys that make noise do that now. Like I can't turn this on anymore because look. That's what it does. So a lot of our toys do that, but I think Piper still likes it even though it doesn't make noise. Now Jackson's gonna check it out. Jackson, can you give Piper a kiss? Give her a kiss on the lips. Or on the head, that's sweet. Head, where's her nose? Nose. Good job. <laughs> So we have the two lightsabers that light up that we gave the kids for Christmas and Uncle Davis gave Jackson this one and I think he likes this one better actually because look he doesn't know how to do that he doesn't know how to do that but he'll bring it to us to do that and then he let's see it and he carries it around and then if it ever goes down then he'll bring it back to me to make it go back up getting a new couch this one's going bye bye Ta da! New couch. Same thing, but not all torn up. How's the new couch? It's so great! Dad? It's nice. Now that it's done, that's what I like to wear off my wrist. I can't even jump on it or bounce on it. Yeah. I think I told you guys the stitching on that couch was coming apart. And so, so anyways, we had a warranty, an extended warranty, and um, so they brought us a new couch, which is nice. And so that one doesn't have a bunch of stitching coming apart. I'm going to the dump. Yep, Chris has lots of errands to run. All right, Daddy is out doing some chores, and it is Jackson and Piper's nap time. Jane, can you give Jackson a hug? <laughs> most of the time he's happy to go to nap and most of the time he is not happy to receive hugs from Jane because most of the time it means he's gonna get tackled or hurt. <laughs> Jane has been loving her kid scissors that she got for Christmas. As you guys know she accidentally cut Piper's hair the other day and she's just been cutting everything. So we decided to make Paper snowflakes. I showed her how to do this. I know it's after Christmas, but it's still winter time, so we'll make a few of these and maybe hang them up. And Jane's never done it before, so she has her paper folded up, and she's about to cut it and make something special. This is what I'm gonna make. Okay. This is gonna be really special. What do you think it's going to be, guys? Cut this part, because this is going to be a square. Alright, so Jane got a little carried away. <laughs> Looks good, but look at her snowflake. It turned out great, I think. So here's our two snowflakes. And now she's just cutting, cutting away everything else, right? Yep, to castles. She's making castles, good yep. job. And you want me to make a castle for you guys? Sure. All right, then I'll work on this. Here's your castle. Good job. I worked so hard on this. So I got one cut of scissors 
But I'm going to try not to cut you guys because I do not want to hurt you guys. That's good. Oh, so we went to UPS yesterday and checked our mailbox and we have one more letter that was in there and I'm pretty sure it came, well I know it came before Christmas and we didn't ever check it so I'm kind of sad but it was from Brazil, from Marie Angela. I hope I say that name right. But this is such a sweet note for Jane. She loved reading it, and she loved her little note from Tinsel, too. So thank you so much for sending that. Um, Jane loves, loves, loves opening up cards, so she was really happy to see that yesterday. All right, we are at Walmart right now, and Jane got a, she got $50 between her birthday and Christmas from all sorts of family members. And we were trying to teach her about money right now. Let her pick some stuff out. What is this? Oh, it's Rapunzel's wedding? Mm -hmm. Is that Rapunzel with dark hair? Mm -hmm. All right, so I think we figured it out. We're getting the $10 shopping cart. You can get that too. She's getting so confused. All right, we're getting the shopping cart, right? We're getting the wedding set, and then you want an Elena doll, right? Mm -hmm. Is that it? Yeah. All right. Here you go, here's Elena doll. That's the $50, we'll give you the $50 when we go check out, okay? And some of you guys are might, might be thinking, why don't you guys put that in her bank account or something, but number one, we saved for her already, and number two, when she gets really big checks, or larger amounts of money, we do put it into our account. But these people that have sent her money for Christmas and birthday have specifically said, take her to get something that she wants. So that's what we're doing. All right, Jane's getting ready to buy her stuff. So you're gonna give her that? Separate from us, so she can learn. Are you sure these are what you want? All right. Put them up here. Put the toys up here first. Put the toys first. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, so you still have five dollars. Okay guys, we are getting ready to end the video, or I am in ending the video. Um, we had a good day today. Jane learned about spending money at the store. She was really excited. She actually loves her set. If you guys don't know, her favorite uh, princess is Rapunzel, and so she got the Rapunzel's wedding thing, and it's the Rapunzel with um, brown hair because she gets her hair cut, cut off if you don't haven't seen the movie and it turns brown <coughs> so Spoiler anyways alert. yeah Jeez. <laughs> just... sorry I figured if you're watching that I mean I feel like everyone knows the story at least right maybe yeah, not no. sorry Why would you have been it then? I don't know well I was just saying like they have she has the doll now with brown hair that she's really excited about that's what she always talks about is the brown hair part I think that's what she was trying to do with Piper the other day. Uh, Cut her hair. Although her hair is already brown. I don't know. Anyways, I hope you guys liked today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.